Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today is Thursday. It is our day to stay at home. Every week I look for at least one day that we just get to stay at home and today's the day. But then we're not home. <laughs> we're headed to Wal we're headed to Costco every month to Costco because we enjoy it. It's like our fun day out. It's to get the things that we need like toilet paper and paper towel and all the stuff that we use in the family. Anyway, we're headed there. I forgot to eat breakfast. I hear Sophie eating. Oh, I didn't even eat breakfast. Um, yeah, last night we took the horses, drove the horses in for a lesson and the lesson was canceled but we still went. We had so much fun. I uh, will put that footage up for you. It'll probably already be up actually yeah you guys will have already seen it probably we had so much fun it was amazing anytime we ride with friends it's just fun it ended up just being the two girls that rode and it just reminded me of the time when like gabby was 11 and got stormed for the first time and you guys remember those videos where she would like jump without she would ride bareback and she would jump without stirrups and she put her arms out and act like she was flying and all that fun stuff when she was young and then she got chino and he's so bouncy she gave that up <laughs> she said i prefer to live <laughs> i still think she should do it but anyway it was so fun chino's just coming back into work so we didn't, I didn't jump chino bareback it is not fun <laughs> She's jumped to Chino bareback. He is not fun. I've tried to sit trot Chino. It's not fun. But she's tried to sit trot Chino and it's not fun. Um, anyway, I'm excited for more fun videos. Just us having fun on our horses. Not just all riding and lessons. And like, I hope that that's what we do this winter. I hope we do more of that. Chino is just coming back into work. So we're not like jumping him and we're not. Uh, doing much more than just building them back up slowly, which is what we always do. It's what we've been taught to do So that's what we're doing taking our time with him and he's uh, Transitioning from shoes to barefoot and doing fabulous, but he does even better with his with his scoop boots on so That's where we are. You are all caught up if you haven't caught up on the other videos. You are all caught up. Oh also uh, The mini is pretty much integrated into our herd. It took us almost three weeks to get her there I love that we were able to take time We've taken it step by step taking it slowly introduced them all slowly through a fence we've gauged how it would work out we've done like our absolute best to integrate her into the herd we believe that horses miniature horses even foals can live in a herd of bigger horses we've seen it we have friends that have them all mixed and we don't just leave her out there we monitor the whole situation so we are in Costco and they have the Lego, and it's ten dollars cheaper, two to twenty dollars cheaper than at Walmart. That's crazy. So they have like all their Christmas toys out. Oh, I, I miss having babies. But I also think this is cool too. It's like a DJ mixer thing. It's got a ball, and you learn to be a DJ. We never had that when we were little. Did Gabby stay in the car? Oh, to be a lazy teenager That's again. Cold in here. I remember doing that myself. This looks like a whole new thing. Like, I've never seen this brand before. But it's actually kind of cool. It's cute, eh? I don't know. It's really cute. I love their display. This is cute. Oh, wow. They're like long. With pants. They're cute. It's a dress and leggings so I buy my kids my grandkids for Christmas I have four of them I buy them something they want something they need something to wear and something to read and just being able to say that helps them like understand what that that those are the rules and the limits I set for Christmas each year so they get something they want and something they need something to wear and something to read so each of them get four presents so their big present is what they want Wow that, that is warm. so soft. Ugly as sin. Just like your pants that you have, but they're warm, so you like Yeah, them. that's right. You're right, Sophie. So well said. But I like the stuff that they sell at Costco because it's different. And truth be told, I end up buying them a lot of uh, clothes. Like the clothing that I buy them is usually from Winners or from Costco. Super cute. I like this sweater too. Yeah, it's thin, but it would be warm. I like it for me. In fact, I love the navy. I want it. And only $21.99. Not gonna lie, I am a Christmas cake fanatic, and this is my favorite cake. 
Doesn't that look so good? All their Christmas stuff. Some Christmas shopping. Yeah, this popcorn is so good. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, I saw these Roblox. I thought Jacob would love those. Doesn't Jacob play Roblox? I thought he'd love those. They're little figures, Roblox figures. I don't know who any of these people are. That's Bob. Yeah, Jacob. I don't know. Jacob would like those. We got this popcorn. It's called French Can Can, and it's spicy jalapeno. Oh my god, it's so good. They let us like have a trial pack, and we, these are all different flavors, but this is the best one. Six ninety nine, best best popcorn spicy it's so good like you can't stop eating it all right so sam's getting lunch we always get lunch at costco and i have this problem if i don't park the car myself i can't find it so i'm lost in the parking lot gabby's in the car so with any luck she will see me oh <laughs> all right so i walked right by the car and she jumped out and said where are you going <laughs> The reason I didn't think this is our car is it looked blue. It looked blue. But look, I got you three taste tests of popcorn. And they're like so good. So good to the point that I made dad buy it for us. Yeah, you just completely left. Yeah, because... You stood there right behind the car. Yeah, that's me. She's like, I videoed it. Oh, you sent it to... Re oh my God, you're not supposed to send it to people. Well, you stood there for like five minutes looking around. Yeah, that's great. Yay, me. Yeah, I don't understand why he bought those. It's me always trying to keep everybody safe and healthy and him destroying the world. <laughs> He's the bad influence. All of our regular stuff like dish soap and laundry soap. Here's the thing. If you can make your child, your teenage child laugh at you, it's a good day. Yeah, he's like, I will never not laugh. At Why did you jump out and say I'm here? <laughs> Tomorrow is the day, you guys. Tomorrow is the day I'm cleaning this barn. I'm just getting so tired of the mess. You know what? It just gets to the point where you can't, where you just can't deal with it anymore. It's about 50 degrees Fahrenheit, 10 degrees Celsius in the barn not warm but tomorrow is the day like i'm not Ew. joking tomorrow is the day gabby just oh i forgot i gotta get my horse <laughs> gabby just came and tagged me but i didn't jump she says so we got some things for her birthday today that she wants help with so that's what we're gonna do right now after i get my horse oh is that what it is she grabbed a grain bucket Tell my horse to come too. She doesn't come for green. I know. She's a girl. She only comes. She only comes if she wants to come. But if I walk out there, Penny will. Yeah, like she only comes if I walk out there. Well, yeah. Okay. Give him a little. You have to give it to him. Yeah, no, he's not a little. Okay. Oh, hello, baby Minnie. Wow, look, she's all pretty and cute and yeah, I brushed and her. brushed. Her belly's not brushed because she got it dirty. Look how, look how dark she is, though. We're gonna do some blanket training. Can you move? All right. I'm I got all the way to her, all the way. And then she's like, "You will never catch me." Oh, good girl. Good girl, Pen. She came to me. That's a shocker, actually. Ready? Go look at the bridge. Go look at the bridge that your dad got for us. Ready? What do you see on the bridge? <laughs> All right, so a baby poop. Gracie poop. Probably more Gracie poo. <laughs> I'm almost sure it was the baby. <laughs> She poops a lot. <laughs> she doesn't care where she does it. The baby pooped on our new bridge, Gabby. All right, I'm gonna just clean up a little bit and then I'll come and brush you, okay? You run into everything? Well, I see it, I avoid it, somehow I hit it. <laughs> that's, that's. <coughs> I purposely avoid it and then I hit it accidentally. That's I my jeans. I don't know how. You don't have a lot of my jeans, but those are my jeans. No, it's probably because I can't even walk straight. Where do I 
I think it's I think it's teenagehood. We're doing some training, blanket training. Good girl. I said I don't want to stand. Look at it. You know how you guys know how Gabby puts blankets on her, horse blankets on her to stay warm. That will not fit you. I mean that would be a good la lap blanket. I put them on my horses. Yeah. I throw All right. Whoa, okay, let's see, and put it on. Go like that and throw it. All right, oh, on, on your horse. horse. Just wait, let's see how much of it will keep Gabby warm. Here, give me it. Oh my gosh, hurry up. Oh, it's like a cape. You're like a super horse girl. Oh my gosh, horse girl has been born. I that is that. adorable. Wait, I could Velcro it. No, oh, give yep. it back. Yesterday, Sophie got uh, some a birthday present, a late birthday present from the Barn Boots and Country Roots family, and she got all these brushes and her own bag, which I'm excited about because essentially that means that I can have all my brushes back. Yeah, she likes that. Which one is that? Julia picked it out specifically for her. It's the one with like the. I've had one of these before, but it broke. Oh, really? I feel like we still have one somewhere. Yeah, my purple one, but it broke. Unicorns on it, and I wanted it, and I actually won it, and then I gave it to Julia. Yeah, that was really kind. I'm Last year we did a Christmas, a Christmas exchange, and we did a little bag. She's like, what are you doing to me? I'm brushing her belly. Remember, don't let her turn into you. Push her head away. Sorry, baby. I actually really like these brushes though, the ones with the wooden handles, because in the past, when the girls were younger, we decorated wooden brushed handles. We're not and decorated. they, glitter. yeah, and they stayed and they like lasted forever. Like they Very are dirty. so good. Well, wow, she's a dirty pony, and she's got a lot of white on her face. So you can't tell what direction her hair on her head goes, but oh, just brush my face. <laughs> It's probably nap time for her. Oh, yes. <laughs> she doesn't have very much mane. Her parents both have a lot of mane though, so it's coming. Hope you guys are in the mood for a good barn cleaning video because that is going to be tomorrow. We are going to clean the barn. Why are you kicking the ball where I need to put my stuff, sister? Are you forgetting something, Mom? What? You can come see. Yeah. Okay, so. Oh. Oh, it's on the bottom. I see it already. All right. Oh. So, I'm going to go open for dog. Oh. Oh, it takes forever to find stuff. So, do you guys remember when Gabby went to advanced camp and they made these, they were supposed to make these reins? Some of the kids were like crying because <laughs> hard maybe maybe it wasn't this craft maybe it was the sewing but anyway the sewing was hard the sewing was hard did you have to sew these no anyway so they were making these and Gabby didn't finish and it was it's been Most like people didn't finish that yeah it was a big project uh we always just kept this because it's like a lot of rope and like some hooks and stuff so we just kept it and we're going to use these today this extra rope and hang up the jolly balls. But so Sophie also got this ball, this jolly ball for her birthday from the Barn Boots family. Isn't that so cute though? She, they tried to stay with a the pink theme for honey. She's like, I'll just come in here and hang out. Well, it's supposed to like taste like peppermint or something, but anyway, that's hers. Aww. And she yeah. might smell it. She's like, that's mine. Yep, that's scissors. Yep, that's Sophie. That's Sophie with scissors. Hey, I'm okay. Yeah, you are. You are okay to take care of your horse. I'm just making a. I'm not making. I'm just making a joke out of it because everybody teases us about us cutting our horse's manes. She's just cutting a little bridle path. All right, so Gabby just went up to the house to get a flame so she can flame burn. Flamethrower. Flamethrower, so she can burn the edges of the rope so it doesn't fray. She comes down and she says. I got a I got a I got dad's new torch. I'm like, did he say you could take it? And she's like, I took it. <laughs> I am making this thing for One honey's stall. And this is what happens when you leave a baby foal unattended tied up. <laughs> okay. She's like, let me chew whatever I can get. 
You touch my Equus bonnets and you're in big trouble. This is it. Oh, I'll test it. So I braided the rope so that it she wouldn't like it wouldn't be doubled so she couldn't strangle strangle herself on it. I put a clip here so that she wouldn't get her foot caught in it. I don't think she'd get her foot caught in here, but I attached it with this little clip and that's her ball. They're over there on that side. So anyway, that's it. That's her ball. Hopefully it holds up. I'm thankful we had all this rope. It matches actually. It's adorable. So that's for her. <laughs> it's actually been. <laughs> it's actually she's doing that. So it's actually been good because she's like just standing here tied up. And this is the first tie she's had, like her actual first tie. And it looks good, Sophie. I think you could have even went back like a tiny bit more. Well, it was hard because she was not cooperating. Yeah, and you don't want to cut her If you push fur. all her baby fluff yeah, down. I saw a baby fluff. Well, hello, ma'am. But if you push all her fluff down, then it's way too big. You know, I should do that to cut it. I'm going to Sophie's still working on her mane. Well, I better do it now. Yeah. All right. Well, that's cute. And even, like, above. Look how good she is. Like... I saw this post on Facebook when we were driving home from Costco and it was this lady who said that she just bought this six month old foal, miniature horse foal, and he was tiny, like three quarters of the size of honey. And she, he was so cute and she said that he was untouched when she bought him. And now just like a few days in, he's the sweetest thing. I swear to God, honey's like that too. Like she's just so sweet. Like. Don't do that. It's so beautiful. Look at how beautiful. I call it baby fluff because I call her baby fluff. Yeah, we call it baby fluff. She's growing her winter coat. You don't want to get confused. I need to get her used to her ears being played with. Because I don't know, but she likes that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's itchy. <laughs> yes. Do it more. Do it more. <laughs> And there's Ruby somehow tangled up in our rope. And that is why I'm afraid to hang things in a full stall. That's exactly how I threw it on her. But I think it'll be okay. Like, there's no way. She can go in and around it. I don't think she's going to get it tangled up in her. She smells it. Be like Penny and push it. I bet Penny would like one of these. I should hang the other one up in the arena. Yeah, she's a rope girl. <laughs> She'll be fine. <laughs> Just hang her a rope. It's bad for horses to chew ropes though because they can like actually swallow it and get it caught in their throat and get it all tangled in their intestines. But that's why I braided this. I'm gonna go look for a kit. And made it thicker and we're gonna watch her with it and make sure she's okay. Because we do know that she does like ropes. I stopped scratching her. Watch, I stopped scratching her. She's not gonna do it. So Sophie just shot. And a video for her channel. She started scratching me so I can scratch her. And she had honey in the video and I literally find myself wanting to push Sophie out of the way and take honey for myself all the I'll time. Kill you. Like I never ever thought I would fall in love so badly with a horse. Like Mine. I mean I love I love oh. Penny so much, but this horse honestly is the best thing. Like she is just the most incredible little Horse. And I know she's going to get crazy and I know she's going to get hormones and be wild, but oh my gosh. I stopped scratching her and then she started scratching me. Yeah, like she is just so sweet and so amazing and so loving and just so good. She's good with the other horses. She's just, oh, she's my dream too. And I just want to push Sophie out of I'm stealing your horse, Sophie. No. I want to steal your horse. I do not accept. <laughs> But I love her. We're trying okay. to get our friend to get one too. Can't okay. Focus eye out because I molded the thing to the wall. All right, all right. And it's soft and. All right. So Gabby did her thing now, and I swear I'm so paranoid about horses. So we'll be watching them with these. Oh. There we go. She got it. Oh, it's high now. Oops. All right. Oh, that looks good. You did it. I said no loops. Like, did you measure it? Kind of. Uh-oh. <laughs> Poof. 
Cat falls on the ground yeah. and she's well, swinging by her arms because <laughs> what are you, my arms would come with me. What are you standing on? Box. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. All right, Gina, what do you think? He doesn't care. He's had it hung up. Before. Yeah, we hung it up before. It's really young. I didn't fall. No, it folded and my legs got trapped there. <laughs> I was holding on to the counter. I think I remember I, that. We discovered that I was very calm. I was like, Mom, <laughs> you gotta help here. You took like an hour getting to me to help. You probably took pictures first. No. <laughs> that, was that was a joke. That was a joke. That was a joke, you guys. That was a joke. All right, uh, Gabby, tomorrow afternoon during the horse's nap time, we are cleaning the barn. So be prepared. Tomorrow is clean the barn day. Don't you know that you're beautiful?